Hey guys, Luck Horse here. Well, I couldn't resist any longer and ended up perching the Icarius Sandana. And honestly, when you get to see it on your frames and in action on the battlefield, it is absolutely amazing value for money and literally puts Limbo Prime's Oblivia Prime Sandana to absolute shame. So let's take a look at this monstrous beauty. Now, the Icarius Sandana was made by Maliu Sharky and JD and is available on PC for $5.99 US through the Ten and Gen 13 release. Now, I first walked away from the arm after perching the Icarius uh, Sandana and the first thing I thought was how the hell am I going to be able to aim with these wonderful wings blocking my view? Well, let's jump straight to seeing how the Icarius Sandana deals with that issue and you'll notice this footage of Mesa in flight that the wings will open in all of its glistening magnificence. Now, when you stop moving for a few seconds, the Icarius's wings will fold up into a compact state. And say you're moving and suddenly come across an enemy, well, when the wings are fully open, as soon as you aim down the sights of your weapon, the wings will compress. Again, just such a great detail for this Sandana. Now let's have a look at the design of the Icarius and it's intricate to say the least. I'm always a sucker for energy effects on frames, Sandanas and all the other fashion frame stuff and uh, this has a really nice energy design. Look at that energy detail in between the wing struts there for example. Now there are plenty of sections on the Icarius which will allow you to colour it to your heart's content and its aesthetic is stylish, sci-fi and just so sleek. The Icarius's base segment fits nicely on Maze's back as you can see here and I really like the mid and lower sections which end in the really detailed ornament section at the bottom and now I've got to be honest I'm really bad with names for items like fashion stuff so specifically for that bottom thing if you know what it's called or it's got a certain name then if you wouldn't mind letting me know in the comment section below that'd be awesome so let's have a look at a couple of other frames who've got the Ikaria Sindana on them including Avara, Loki Neza, and look how well it sits with Neza's chakram and the ribbons on his back. Some other Sandanas have real issues with clipping, but this just fits so beautifully and so well. It, it really, I can't say it enough, just how well it's been designed and how well it fits with frames. And Trinity Prime. So we've had a look at this beauty, we've talked about its cost and seen how it fits on frames, but is it good and should you buy it? Well, let's be honest, it's an incredibly easy yes. And if your financial situation allows, then this Sandana that will work on multiple frames is incredibly epic and you won't regret purchasing it. I hope you've enjoyed this vid and the look at the Ikaria Sandana. And I've got to say again, just how good the work of Maliu, Sharky and JD has been on this particular Sandana. It is absolutely epic. Let me know in the comments section below what you think of the Icaria Sandana and if you've already picked it up already. Remember to hit that like and subscribe button if you enjoyed this vid and hope to see you in Warframe sometime. Cheers.